Why do you always wait till after we leave to have interesting thoughts to say? Some of us are just cursed. Because it's been like three times in a row we stop, we leave, and then then we stop recording, and then you become the most talkative person I've ever known in my entire life who has all these fun, interesting stories. I don't know, but the first thing I want to say is... Agents of chaos. (laughs) Agents of chaos. Oh, yeah, agents of chaos. Agents of chaos. Fuck. Hey, hey. agents of chaos. It's good. good. Let's keep (laughs) keep around with this joke now. (laughs) Fucking, no, every, like, I want to say 800th hit, maybe... I can taste the oranges at Soren. Hmm. It's cool. It, it's actually dope. It's a rare thing, but every every now and then it happens. It just happened when I came in here. It's such a nice feeling. That's actually sick as that actually that actually is sick as fuck. Yeah, uh, it is a chaos, dude. Dude, Jesus fucking Christ! It's like you asked me to do a favor. Mm-hmm. I did it. Then th- then you're like, did you do my favor today? Yes. What, what really? Yeah. Thanks. Yep. But you actually did it. Yeah. I'm just surprised you did it. Uh huh. I mean, no, but this is why I thought you wouldn't do it. Though. It's like, can you shut the fuck up? Yeah. That's fair. And that's not really a good example of Agents of Chaos. I lost it because I was too consumed with the fact that it took me 95 minutes to piss just now and I pissed fucking 10 minutes prior. I'm sorry. I know. What did you... I lost all my train of thought. What? What was the issue? You pissed too long, too frequently. Yes. What I complained about two weeks ago. Yeah, I wasn't arguing with against you before. You were two weeks ago. No, I was arguing with you because you just just have to pick on me nonstop. I wasn't arguing with... Your facts are correct, which you also established, I think, last week. Mm Mm-hmm. That, yeah, you're right. I'm just, it's annoying that you have to always point out you're right. Okay, that's, that's basically what the argument was. Mm-hmm. But you did, in fact, have to go pee for so long, so freaking that you lost your train of thought. I was on a roll, had to then get interrupted by it. Then you and I start fighting upstairs, and you're like, dude, you have to know the difference. I'm like, oh, yeah, you're mm-hmm. right. Let's talk about this later on. I have to bring up the fact that I can never tell the difference. This is why I can't tell the difference. Then I'm pissing for 15 fucking minutes, why and I forgot what I was so talking long? about. Huh? Like also, for reference, okay, you peed. St- you, you had, like, a sip of water since the last time you pissed, and you had to pee again. I had a whole bottle since I last pissed. Okay, fine. One bottle of water. That's 16 me. ounces. I think it's a fair amount to have to piss again afterwards. I agree, but I, didn't, I don't know why your fucking You should come body, to work with me one day. I don't know why. You, I shouldn't. I don't know why Every your body. Every half hour and the half hour, I'm pissing. Goes, just, it's like, a sh- everyone else has, like, the, you know, the, the, it goes this way, this way. You're just a straight tube free from your mouth to your dick. No, okay? you no, no, no. The problem you is that no you brought this up six weeks ago. Only a dick. No, you brought this up, what? I said you have no imagination. Only a dick. <laughs> You brought this up six weeks ago. The problem is I used to drink one bottle of water every six weeks. Now I drink six waters a day. My body can't handle it. Again, and that's not that mass water. That's a good amount. That's not like a crazy amount. You should be pissing You're right. Much. It's not a crazy amount. You didn't You didn't hear the math increase, I guess. I said one bottle per six weeks versus six bottles per day. It's a massive increase. You know what in I heard, Robbie? Intake. What'd you hear? No. And then you I, know heard, what I heard what? What'd you hear? What I heard was Stellar. Robbie good. should do better. I, <laughs> You're so right. You're so right. I don't know why I always forget that. It's such an obvious <laughs> dude. My name is in the lesson. I can't remember it. <clears throat> okay, we're gonna pretend this is not script. We're gonna pretend this is uh rehearsed. I'm just gonna meet my microphone, and you're gonna do what I tell you. So, so no one's gonna realize this is this is rehearsed. Mm-hmm. All right. So um, yeah, dude, why don't you do better? You just gotta be. It's better behave by yourself there better. There you go. Man, that was. Dude, I can't even thought that so quickly on your own completely. I don't have to influence <laughs> from anyone else. Yeah, I've tried. The problem is, I keep trying to think of better ways to say that because I can't do the impression that well. Mm-hmm. I'm trying to think of ways to say it before. I did it before, but you didn't catch it. <clears throat> I, I think I did, but uh, yeah. But you didn't. You would have commented on it, or at least I would have assumed you would. Because whenever you say something that's a good reference, you need me to immediately tell you how good a reference that was. So I thought you would have done the same thing for me in return. I didn't point it out because I didn't. I didn't realize I had to do that for you. But you you're thought, right. what you thought? You're right, my mistake. <laughs> you're right. Why so what I heard that? is, Robbie, why can't you do better? <laughs> you're so right. Why do I keep forgetting that? You literally just told me that. It was conversation. It literally just happened. That's crazy. Say the butters thing, dumbass. I just gotta behave myself. <laughs> See, literally the whole setup again. So it will be natural this time. You're like, I'm not gonna say it the second time in a row. You're right, Alex. It wasn't funny. The conversation literally repeated itself. That wasn't funny enough. It I had was to do your funny. Part. And then it could have been so much funny if you actually did the joke, but you refuse to because you hate children. You hate people laughing. Why can't I just be better? I just gotta behave myself. There we go, I'm baby. Kidding. Third time's the charm. You know what's funny? We talked about this in the episode I mentioned two weeks ago. So we had an episode four weeks ago I mentioned two weeks ago about how I liked that episode. <laughs> <laughs> I like now. I don't know what the fuck I was gonna we say because you just to fucking break my ago. flow. Oh, we talked about how my favorite character on Weeds is Andy, 
And I said how I relate to Andy the most because I feel like I've gone through those emotions he's gone through and I can relate to the things he talks about. However, not to the same height that he might have gone through them. A, and B, he's way cooler than I am. I was going to say, you ever got with Nancy, so. Huh? So you, I, I don't recall you ever being with Nancy. Yeah, another occurrence of our common theme. I'm a loser. <laughs> Alex, colon. Winner. You're also a loser, by the way, right? You mentioned this point how you're a loser. Robbie, colon. You're right. I am a loser. I don't know why I didn't point out that other story about how I'm a loser. Thank you, Alex. Get to it, Robbie. (laughs) So on fucking South Park, the character I relate to the most is Butters, I think. He's my favorite character. It's weird how Butters' parents constantly ridicule him (laughs) when he doesn't do things the way they want him to, whether he does it the right way or not. It's never the right way because it's not the way they want it to. You just proved that That you did it. Sounds like mom and dad, yeah. And you! It's so weird how the no. character I relate to has the same fucking parental experience that the character you know has, including this? his younger you know brother. I, I feel I like another parent. I, I could do you. better. I think the world revolves around you. <laughs> maybe. What else? <laughs> and that maybe you should be a little more considerate of people. <laughs> I'm just going to behave myself <laughs> Exactly. More. Fuck you, Alex. <laughs> I wish I could do a Butters impression so much. Yeah. The only impression I can do from South Park is <laughs> the Japanese one, and I can't do that on here. Loophole. You know, Alex is a lot better at impressions than I am. <laughs> I'll just roll with this. Oh, sh- you know, sh- hold, sh- sh- hold, roll with this. I wish I was better at impressions. It's something not really good at. Alex is really good, actually, and he, he usually can do really good spot on ones. Uh, you do a lot of actor ones. We do a lot of good character ones, too. One of which is uh, the the guy that runs City Walk in South Park. Can you do that impression for us, Alex? City Shushi, I'm sorry. City Shushi. You're not the good City Walk impression. Your City Shushi is way better. Oh, no. This is a racial stereotype. <laughs> now, that's a direct quote. That's not, there's no, there's no, there's no, there's no personal agenda. Um, that's just me, that's just me quoting something. So that's perfectly legal. It's safe here, actually. Just like, you know, the, to, to, you know, informatively, it'd be illegal to say something such as you wanted to kill the president of the United States of America. But you can't actually say you did. But, okay, okay, well, yeah, there's the joke. There's the punchline. Because since I said to you in an informative matter, it wasn't legal at all. Yeah. See what I mean? Yeah, I do see what you mean. That you I need thought to do I was helping because you complained before how I didn't ever add to the point, and you were well, talking I don't, I don't for a recall while. In the why is kid you know skit where the other guy just came out and started talking. Yeah, I also don't recall some other guy who's not on the whitest kids you know <laughs> doing the bit verbatim and trying to play it off like it wasn't. Yeah, I was trying so hard to play it off like it wasn't. That's why I just said it's the whitest kids you know. I know. I'm trying to let them know they did. And I don't recall the blonde guy who wasn't as funny walking into the skit and being like, oh. Well, I finished the joke here. I just got to behave myself exactly. better. Exactly. You fuck, dude. Robbie, can you just do better and be better, please? More consistently. Try harder. I'm sorry. Lie Alex. for longer. What? I said lie for longer. What? Excuse me? A lie for longer? Yeah. Like, I need to keep lying to you? Like, keep up the charade. Oh, that's good. My whole life's a charade. Oh, you're not going to add anything? <laughs> oh. I, I, I cut you off or I don't talk at all and I can't win Robbie I cannot win with you apparently if I don't let you talk that's a problem and if I go to talk it's also a problem it's just so funny how you bitch non-stop and then when I do one thing to let you speak you just can't take up you complain how I don't give you also whenever I talk you pick up your fucking phone and start texting when am I supposed to fucking speak you're right this is what you need it's good you're right you're, oh my god you're sorry I realized, I realized what this fucking dynamic is you said upstairs that I don't understand our dynamic because I need to just realize it's just a give and take of us joking back and breaking each other's balls no 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 that's not what it is it's you destroying me at every fucking little ounce of my fiber <laughs> to a fucking deep molecular level and then when I finally explode you're like that's what I want give me more give me more you're the Stanley Kubrick in this relationship you just won't be having something fucking destroyed and you know what I'm gonna miss you you're gonna miss me when you're in another set go (laughs) fuck yourself (laughs) when you're in another when you're in another set okay and he calls cutting you it's not there yet you're gonna miss me it's it's interesting that it applies so directly here because this is scripted it is scripted so it works out perfectly yeah yeah Cool, cool. <laughs> oh, that'd be funny. It wasn't. So let's talk about that. Why wasn't it funny, Robbie? Because it wasn't actually set up know. for anything. It was just a statement. I don't know. <laughs> I honestly, God, I have no idea why that wasn't funny. <laughs> Comparatively to everything else I said prior was funny, but for some reason, your everything tone changed. No, because for some reason, everything was prior. I don't know why my tone changed though. 
So all you just, so basically, stabbed. you need to do better. <laughs> so I got to hate myself. It's three weeks in a row. You need to do better. I don't get it, though. I don't know what switches <laughs> off for it to stop. It just stops all of a sudden. I guess because the things happen organically. Yeah, pick up your phone and keep texting. Blame our parents. I'm sorry. I don't care. Keep talking. You notice how I didn't pick up my phone at all during this episode? Yeah. It's weird how I give you the respect to say your points. And when I give you the respect to say your points, you, know, you Robbie, say, why are you talking, Rob? You know what? What? I apologize. That was big of you. Thank you. I appreciate that, Alex. I'm, I would never expected that. I'm just, thank you. That was a very heartfelt <laughs> apology. <laughs> I hope you accept my uh, heartfelt acceptance of your apology. So it's all about, about you now and how you'll be better than me? <laughs> I don't know. I thought maybe the guy has to keep improving himself. <laughs> ergo, yeah, it's all about, all about ergo you. Ergo me. I said a minute ago, Robbie, the world revolves around you. Even when I have a moment of my niceness, my kindness is about how you accept it and how you were kind and big enough to accept it. I, just gotta I, can't, I, can't, I can't with you, Robbie. I just got to behave myself better. Mm -hmm. God, you fucking narcissist. We should no. We should actually start saying narcissist the right way and slowly divulge getting further and further and further mispronouncing it. You see what I'm doing here? <laughs> yep, I caught that. So we're going to start. And then we, say, we start off by saying narcissist, but then it's narcissist. And it just keeps getting worse into like these, these non-even human verbal noises anymore. Just these grunts of narcissist. That's the evolution of the show. We, dude, we took podcasting back from podcasting to being a, a, a time block television series. And then we're going to take it back into a radio show. And we're going to take it back into a fucking uh, like a theater production. We're going to take it back. And we're going to go back to the existence of time. We're going to take it back to people that have to literally come to us. So we can With orally fire. tell it to them. Yeah. And we build fire and we dance with the gods. Yes. Yep. That was one of those things where I fucked up again. <laughs> it's crazy. The tone doesn't even... Ch I pointed this out to you yesterday or two days ago. I was listening to one of our episodes, and there's a moment where I'm talking at my normal tone, and then when I get excited, I start talking, and the excited version of Robbie doesn't sound at all like the other version of Robbie to the point where someone listening who doesn't know me would think that's three people talking in the room, <laughs> and that really bothered me, and then I started talking too long now, and I forgot my train of thought. The train went that way, and I hopped off. You want to just do a choo-choo while you're at it? I did the choo-choo. Yeah, you didn't even commit to it fully. <laughs> oh, then it comes to tone shift thing, but I don't know why I said the other point. Anyways, the tone shift. I don't know the t like. I say something, I'm like, I get on the roll, and I'm like, okay, I feel good about myself. Let me say the next thing that pops into my head, and the next thing that pops <laughs> into my head is not good, and I immediately feel bad about myself. So maybe... Think before you speak. Maybe just don't feel good about myself. That's the problem. I feel no, constantly no, mad at myself. Just, just think before I have you to speak. behave better. You're right. Just I think before you speak. I should stop talking entirely. I I need to think before I speak. So I, I need to behave speak. myself. Yeah. All right. Um. This is your turn now. It's my, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm pass what? the ball to you. This is my turn now. Yeah. You can you can do that. Wasn't thing I so talking much. for most of this? I feel like I did a lot of talking these last, okay. these last couple of weeks. I agree with that more than I usually do. But I don't think you've done enough where you can just be like, I've done my part. Here you go. <laughs> okay, technically what you're saying is fair. However, you talk, usually you talk 90% of the time, mm -hmm. and I talk 10% of the time. And you complain about that, don't you? So then this week I spoke 40%, mm -hmm. and your 90% stayed the 90%. Just right. Your 90% got smaller than the 100%. My 40% got Almost bigger. Almost as if my 90% stopping 90% became <laughs> 60% and your 40 your temperature became 40%. Right. Hold on, I'm not saying this right. You're not listening very well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're not listening at all. That's why you didn't hear what I said. Yeah. I'm just not I'm not, just not I'm just not understanding you. No, you're not listening. That's why you didn't yeah. hear what I said. <laughs> you like how I'm saying listening in here because they mean different things that I'm using. That's funny. Mm -hmm. it's, Alex, acknowledge how funny that is. It's funny. You yeah. want to acknowledge after every bit on your fucking joke. Acknowledge every bit on my joke. Laugh. Laugh. I don't know what I was talking about. That's the only problem. I can't remember. Dude, things. it's like damn if I do, damn if I don't. If I let I'm you go, if I let you run free, we run yeah. in circles. And if I got the conversation, I'm a fucking dickhead. Yeah, really. Yeah, it sucks being you, dude. It's hard. It's hard being omniscient all the time. Yeah, it's hard. <laughs> it's hard being, being God, me. Alex. I'm oh, sorry. It's hard being God, dude. <laughs> who, who does God complain to? It's so true. I'm sorry. <laughs> what, God? what God was one of us? I often think about that. That concept you just brought up. You're on a bus. If God was one of us. Mm -hmm. Every time I deal with a person, and this is not me trying to be funny, every time I deal with a person and I handle that situation less nicely than I What is than different from this of, than when you're currently talking, usually? 
What? You said I'm not trying to be funny. I'm like, how is it different from when you're usually talking? Oh, because I'm just naturally funny. Oh. Right now, I'm not yeah, 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 naturally okay. funny. This is just accidentally funny. Okay, you're, you're just so charismatic and charming that even though you're trying to turn off the humor, it escapes you, and everyone can't help but be joyous around you. So <laughs> even good qualities have consequences. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying so hard. <laughs> what was I saying? If you're talking to God... Oh, like, like the one of my oh one of my favorite stories is when I finally fucking yelled at that person at Home Depot. But then I'll have that thought ten minutes later, like, well, what if that was God? And that yep, was a test. God and works at Home Depot. No, 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 Dude, no. God. No, 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 that's not what that means. That's not what that means at all. It doesn't mean God's hanging out working at Home Depot at the fucking nine to five every day of the week. That's not what that means. It means for a split second, God was there and, and, and maybe assumed that person for a split second, and that was the test to see if I can pass things. I failed. Nah, so dude, I'm gonna ask. Home Depot was not hollowed ground. I can't believe I said that. I can't believe I said that. (laughs) (laughs) Mark the time slot and cut that. I'm so sorry. (laughs) We were on such a good flow. I thought I could just speak freely for a second and joke like no one would care. (laughs) Oh, Oh, that's so funny. It's not funny. That's a bad fucking sign of things to come. <laughs> We're going to be on some late night talk show on national television live where they can't fucking cut it back. I'm going to sl- slip and say something I shouldn't say. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Calm down. No, because that was funny. And I said it I knew it would be funny. Robbie, you're making it seem way worse than it is. Now you're, making, now you're going too, 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 too far. <sighs> Thank Jeez God it was all man. scripted, though. Thank God it was all scripted. Thank yeah. God this entire show is scripted. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God we can blame the writers. I yeah, know. Fuck those guys. <laughs> so what you're saying I honestly have no fucking idea what I was saying at this point it was something just oh no God doesn't work in Home Depot because it's not hollowed ground oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 uh. <coughs> oh my god since you repeated yourself I sincerely contemplated just saying the same thing again that would have been funny it would have been do you want to just repeat yourself a third time? If so only I- it was like. The problem is you're not going to remember that you need to edit that part out. Anyway, you're just going to upload it and no one's going to know that something's supposed to be edited out. So you're saying that you need, that again, it's you need to do better and that I have to deal with stuff and I don't get to complain and I just do everything. Yeah. I see. I see. I see. Interesting. Basically, I see your note mm-hmm. and I raise you. Mm-hmm. This, this, this note. Can you not go on your phone while we're doing the stuff so I don't feel disrespected like you did earlier? All right, super unprofessional. Yeah, it really kind of was. And it's honestly a little rude that in this episode you're going to chastise <clears> me <throat> and I'm going to give you a heartfelt apology. And then within the span of 10 minutes, you do the exact same thing unto me. You're so right. You're so right. I just need to do better. Like, honestly, I, to hold on. I know, I know you're going to say something. Just, just hear me out. I went on a whole... To be honest, it was a little over the top. Complained about you before, mm-hmm. about you don't respect things that I say. In right. reality, I don't respect the things that you say, mm-hmm. and I just respect carte blanche respect in return. You're right. That's not mm-hmm. that's not fair, and I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. And I'm sorry to you. And I'm sorry to those listening. Right. And I'm sorry, mom and dad. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, <laughs> I guess they played him off. <laughs> no, that sounded the way I was trying to make it sound. Uh, so we got like, yeah, you know. I was trying to make foot, trying to say? Foot, footprint sounds. Because you were trailing off. That's what you were trying to say? What was your point? <sighs> I don't know. I had a point before you told me not to say to you until we got into the podcast. Fuck it. I wanted to. I mentioned before about shooting myself, but instead of shooting myself, I thought. Why would you. Robbie, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> That was, there's a point there. There's a point here. I'm getting to a point. Oh my God. You said I should tell this thing about before. Uh huh. All right. I'll just, you talk. You're right. It's wrong when I talk. You talk. I got to do better. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you talk. You talk for So less much editing in this episode because of you. It's well, that one, the whole streamlined process. I could have went through the point on that one, but. You can't say <laughs> out loud. You, but you know what you shouldn't do if you're depressed? You instead. Well, now you have to edit this part. You I know, shit, I have to edit this part because you're a fucking idiot! 
Well, you know what? Maybe if you let me talk more often, I wouldn't fuck up the few times I do get to talk. I'd be able to Maybe if I let you more. talk more often, when I let you talk, there'd be less occurrences of you saying dumb things. Yeah, because occasionally I get to talk, what, once every 90 times you speak? Mm -hmm. So that one time I just want to say everything I could possibly think. So everything just comes so out. So you're right. Unfiltered. If I gave you 90 chances to talk, you'd say everything you think. No, I said the one first thing I thought, which was oh fine to say. Oh, my God. I'd say the only thing I would think of that was okay to say. But because I don't get to speak ever, every thought I think, I just comes flying out unfiltered. I don't get a chance to think before I speak. I have to do better. It's my fault. You're right. I'm sorry. The amount of pressure, dude. I have. That's the stuff I have to handle, man. Yeah, but the amount of guilt I have now, I don't know if I should keep the talking. The way the world I have up. on my shoulders 24-7, it's completely unfair. I'm sorry. I mean, you created me in your image, and I'm acting this way now. It's <laughs> fucked up. I'm sorry. <laughs> now, that's sacrilegious, Okay. Yeah, these jokes are funny, but I do feel a little, a little, a little. No, bad. you crossed the line, Robbie. Yeah, I feel like I'm crossing a little bit of a line. <laughs> that's that's today's episode. It's just you constantly crossing the line. It's like four times in one episode. That's actually funny. Now we can bleep, just bleep random stuff out, so no one knows I said something you had to bleep ah, out before. Oh, okay. See, no so, so, I, so I got to do more work for this. You're saying again? Our, our audience is so dumb. I have to do more work. You're saying our audience is so dumb. I got to do more work, and you can just do whatever you want. Our audience is yeah. dumb. That's okay, they're not going to realize you just threw bleeps out there for bleeps. Yeah, you bleep out that last part, but the audience being dumb. It wasn't that funny or cool or smart at all. Yeah. I mean, you could you could go with that reason. See, Whatever, I thought I, I thought. Let's just see how much work you can pile off me. Just start saying other stuff, man. No, it's happening, and the tone's shifting. I'm fucking up. I got I got I got to be quiet for a second. <laughs> fall back in the character. I guess this is a to be continued, guys. Yes, so.